unfortunately it's a situation that has to be addressed. Uh, children have to be able to go to school and feel that they're going there in safety uh, to assure their parents. People need to be able to go to worship. First on Fox right now, Jewish communities around the world are beefing up security. Well, they are. It's all thanks to growing anti-Semitic messages from terrorists following those deadly attacks in Paris. Fox 17's Michaela Lewis live in Metro Center tonight. Michaela, this is impacting our Jewish community right here in the mid-state. Well, Scott and Stacy, right now, Facebook and Twitter seem pretty harmless to all of us using it from day to day. But President Barack Obama says this is also how terrorist groups communicate. Now, the Jewish Federation and Foundation of Nashville and Middle Tennessee says it works with communities in Europe and other parts of the world that are working on security issues in their Jewish centers. With the horrific terrorist attacks in France last week, the needs for safety measures are skyrocketing right now. The Gordon Jewish Community Center is a place that many people come to tend to their spiritual health and their physical well-being is something on the mind of Mark Friedman here in Bellevue and Jewish community leaders worldwide. There are still terrorist cells all over the world emanating out of the Middle East that are bent on killing Jews. Counterterrorism operations continue with sweeping raids in Europe like here in eastern Belgium Thursday night. Intelligence agencies report as many as 20 sleeper cells with hundreds of followers ready to strike in places like France and Germany. President Barack Obama says terrorists are communicating primarily through social media. When we have the ability to track that, in a way that is legal, that's a capability that we have to preserve. The Jewish Federation's France Emergency Fund. Friedman is the director of the Jewish Federation and Foundation of Nashville and Middle Tennessee. With places like Great Britain adding police patrols at Jewish centers, Friedman says financially, Semitic communities' security needs worldwide are going from $200,000 to more than $10 million now as a result of attacks on France last week and others prior. Both a, a tragic situation and a necessary situation at this point in time. Now, Friedman won't comment on if there is any additional security being implemented in the Nashville facilities, but he says that safety is always a priority. Parents to feel that they can come here and be safe and sound, and we do the best possible job that we can. Friedman says it's not just a heightened concern for Jews. The terrorism has no boundaries. It's completely ideologically based. And until we find the means, all of the world working together to resolve itself, to destroy this evil, we're going to have to deal with it. Now, Mark Friedman says one way to unite against terrorism is through the Jewish Federation and Foundation of Nashville and Tennessee, Middle Tennessee's France Emergency Fund. Now, you can not only donate, but you can also send a message of condolence or solidarity. For more information, you can visit our website at fox17.com. Live from the newsroom, Michaela Lewis, Fox 17 News.